What's up guys, Adam C here for Hidden Jackpots. I'm with Joanne again. We're just heading out from the motel. Sabo Beach Lodge. We're gonna head down to the street by the beach and walk down to the main street here in Sabo Beach. Not sure if we're gonna walk on the beach or on the street, but the weather is not really beach weather today. It's not raining yet, but it's just not sunny. The weather's still nice, the temperature. So uh, come with us, That's let's okay. go. I got beach hair, don't care. Yeah, already. <laughs> So the Sabo Lodge is on 2nd Avenue North, which is, as you can see, literally one block from the beach. And at the end of the street, there's a beach entrance even. You can see that's Lake Huron in front of us. What time is it? It's 10.51 a.m. It's like so quiet out here. It's super quiet. You can still hear crickets. I love it. One thing I noticed on our last walk, which is hilarious, is you can hear our steps. Yes. <laughs> you hear the crunching of the rocks. I like it. It smells like horse poop. It does smell like horse poop. What is that? It's a church. We're going to building. church. Yeah. It's a weird looking church. Worship is at 1030. Huron Feathers. Maybe we'll walk on this boardwalk so you guys can see the beach and then maybe we'll walk down the main street. One thing that's cool. So this street was packed yesterday. The, yesterday there was no parking down It's like here. ghost town right now. There's only a few cars right now. I mean, this, I'd still sit at the beach for a while. Apparently this beach is 11 kilometers long and we have porta potties along the way, which is nice. Let's take a look at this little boardwalk. And there's like so many accesses from the street, too. Yeah, there's access all around. These are the great. dunes, they're protected. They don't walk on the I dunes. Don't. Yeah, there's like nobody on the beach, oh my God. <laughs> but you can see the weather, so this you can understand. This is beautiful, though. I'd still sit here until the raindrops fell, and even then I'd probably still sit here for a little bit longer. So you want to walk along the beach? Sure. All right. Are you kidding? Walk my along the beach. My toes are in sand. <laughs> Maybe I'll find some driftwood. Maybe. There's people at the beach. There's some, well, there's some people further. down there. I guess oh. with kids, you want to get them out and get their energy burned off until as much as you can until the rain starts. Well, hopefully it doesn't rain. I hope not. If it just stays cloudy, I'd be fine with that. Me too. I'd still come down here and sit. Let's bring a sweater. Definitely don't think I'd swim today. No, it'd be chilly when you got out of the water. <laughs> I never even thought about it. I can actually swim because of my tattoo. It's still healing. Lake water is probably not a great idea. Probably not. Since it's just been only a few days, not even a week. So maybe on the way back, we'll walk down the street and then we can show them some of the cottages. Mm-hmm. Watch out for the little potholes these kids make. Morning. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, there's Lake Huron. There's a beach chicken. A beach chicken. <laughs> so Mike from Finding Fish, this video is for you. The beach walk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not quite Cuba, but this is a really nice beach when the sand is dry. It's not white sand, but yeah. it is pretty nice. It's pretty soft and fluffy though when it's dry. It is. I'll take it. This could be like Canadian Cuba. Canadian Cuba. With better food. With, yeah, with better food. 
11 kilometers of beach here in Savo. It's all the way down that, like it's almost to that point, I think. Let's take a look. That is a lot Quite of a beach. Ways away. Definitely if you had a bike like that guy that was just driving by us, you could, I would ride that every day. That bike had huge tires. I know, that's what you need though. Plow through the sand. You gotta watch out for these little rivers that the kids dig. <laughs> uh, to be a kid again. I know, I'm not gonna lie, I used to love doing that as a kid. Building sand castles. It's actually people in the water. Two children. <laughs> oh, oh, look at the butterfly. There's a monarch butterfly oh. which just flew away and I didn't get it in time. Butterflies are so erratic and hard to catch on video. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite windy. Mm -hmm. It's okay, it's drying my hair. What's that? It's drying my hair. <laughs> You can see all the sand dunes there. You know what they need down here is, what are they called? Palapas? <laughs> uh, palapas would be great. There's a few of those down here, but they would be gone in a second. Yeah, it's hard to say. It's people Probably like their though. shade. Well, yeah. yesterday it was sunny out and you saw all the tents that people brought yeah. and umbrellas, more so umbrellas, not tents. Look at this, this is a little city. The kids had some fun. Somebody built a little city here. Pretty cool. <laughs> oh. I'm guessing when the tide comes up a little bit, the water will run into It'll that. Be like hole. a little river. I see what they were going for. <laughs> the water's so pretty. It's really clear the water here too. I'm not going to get too close because I don't want to get wet. Listen to that some forever. spots there's some of these the shells well those are rocks but there is some shells along the beach I don't know if you guys can hear the waves rolling in there's the dry fluffy sand oh the good sand is up here See, a day like today would be a great day. Even though it's not, not sunny, you can't sun pan, but you could definitely have a good afternoon nap down here. Oh yeah, I could nap down a here. I <laughs> can fall asleep to those sounds in a minute. Heck yeah. I don't know what that's supposed thing. to be. I know, I was just looking at that. <laughs> what the heck it's supposed to be? I don't be. know what they're planning on doing there. There's another... Oh! Looks like a toilet. It does look like a toilet. I hope it's not. <laughs> Please don't poop in the, on the beach. Driftwood. Yesterday I'd seen so many pieces, today I'd see nothing. Driftwood? Yes. I don't even think I saw any yesterday. There are like little pieces. Oh. Got crafty ideas going on in the brain. <laughs> uh, up here is the uh, drainage thing that comes out to the water. I might have to walk through some mud. Oh, your toes will handle it. It's okay. You can see the seagull tracks in the... the seagull feet? Look at it. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there he is right there. Running away. <laughs> I 
Oh, he's an angry one, that one. <laughs> Just saying good morning, don't put me on camera, my hair's not done. <laughs> So we got to figure out how to get across this waterway here. I don't want to get wet. I know it sounds funny, I'm at the beach and I don't want to get wet, but I don't want muddy feet. I don't think I'm going to have a choice. No. <laughs> Just uh -oh. tread lightly. So it doesn't Here's the shells the I was talking here. about. Some parts are a little shelly. Maybe I'll go down by the water there and try and get across. It looks... I don't know. It's fine. It's just wet sand. Just go like I'm this. I'm going to sink. It's hard. Oh, it's not bad. It's packed. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. I did it. I did it. A little bit. I got a little bit wet. <laughs> what do you call those? Um, paddle boards. No, no. Seagulls. Oh, beach chickens. Beach chickens. I thought you were talking about the ladies there. No. They're going out to paddleboard. Yes, I'd love to try that. Paddleboards. I don't know if my old grandma needs to hold up to that. I definitely would duff it in the first two minutes. I'd be right in the water. <laughs> yep. Hmm. Apparently it's very good though for you. There's some driftwood. Yeah, not the ones I'm looking for. They need people to come out here and clean up the beach. That's I don't know if you can see all the garbage over yeah. there. Yeah. Maybe they do have people. They probably do. They just haven't gotten to it this morning. It is still... Well, it's not even that early, really. It's 11 o'clock now. Seagulls are having a feast today. The seagulls love it. There's That's a butterfly lot. again, but yeah. you can't see it. No, you won't be able to see that on camera. I bet you it's still going to get busy down here. Oh, yeah. A lot of people may have left, too. If they were here for the week, and now the weekend people will start rolling in. Maybe. That's true. What's the, oh, today's Friday. Today's Friday. Look at that seagull. It's huge. The big brown guy? Yeah, look at that guy. Yeah, he's had some good meals. He's big and brown. He's big. That's a steer clear from that guy. Look at him go. wingspan on him. Almost looks like a hawk flying away. That's a big seagull. <laughs> it is. I don't think I've ever seen a seagull that big before. It's the king of the beach. Well, look at Oh. This one looks like it used to be a crab or something. Or an octopus. And look, we got an alligator over here complete with teeth. Well, it's a little demolished. Somebody but squashed it. That's rude. That, that used to be like a crocodile that or something. That looks really cool. They even went to like the extent of giving it nails. Yeah, nails and teeth. Teeth, that's amazing. That'd be neat to see some sand sculptures out here. smell a barbecue. I know, it's a little early for barbecue, but... Mm. Well, not really, because it's 11 o'clock. Really. It's almost lunch. You'd be doing, like, pea meal bacon on the barbecue or something. Ugh, I'm or hungry. Almost coming up to the main street here. Well, it looks a little far away in the camera here, but... Don't forget, if you're liking this video, hit that subscribe button. Give the video a thumbs up. I appreciate it. So does Joanne, right? Heck yeah. <laughs> Some of you watching might not know about Sable Beach, Ontario. It's one of the few places there is no Tim Hortons. Oh, boo. There is no McDonald's. No Burger King, no, no. nothing. There's only, the only 
fast chain food chain I saw was what? Subway. Subway, Pizza Delight, and Pizza Pizza we saw at the grocery store. Yeah, and Pizza Delight isn't even available in Anywhere. many places, really. <laughs> really? Like, I think there's a Pizza Delight in Port Elgin up here. Maybe. In here. There is a Tim Hortons in Port Elgin. It's what, half hour, 40 minutes? Yeah, I'd probably say about a half hour away from here. So if you're like me, you hmm. may walk in a snowstorm to get your Tim Hortons. <laughs> And I think the weather app said it's about 21 degrees here. With the breeze, it might be a little cooler, but it's still nice. Very nice, though. <laughs> this guy's getting his fitness on. Yep. It's karate on the beach. I don't know why this fence is here. Oh, well, maybe that's when they used to, used to be able to park on the beach here. So they probably put up that rope so cars didn't come past it to park. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I lied. I don't think he was getting his fitness on. I think he was doing a puff and stuff. Oh. <laughs> There's people out in the water. They're braver than I am. There's that house that we liked last night. No, that's the restaurant. Oh, those are the restaurants. Yeah, there's a couple of restaurants we went past there. The houses. That is the hotel that we liked back there. Yeah, it's we're not gonna open yet. We're going to walk by some of the hotels and cottages and restaurants on the way back which you will see this could be a longer video or a two-parter i don't know we'll see maybe right now it's only 16 minutes these people got the setup over here yeah seagulls are going nuts We got some house of pain on. You can't hear that? Blah, blah, blah. Don't listen to the music. <laughs> no need copyright. It wasn't that loud. You guys probably couldn't hear it. No. I could barely hear it. Oh, look. Oh. There's a kid going on the zip line. He's done now almost. They have that adventure park over I there. I so want to do that, but I'd be the crazy one that would just like be like an aerial person that's just spinning out of control. <laughs> I would not even try that because I'm scared of heights. It's not really that high, but... I'm scared of heights too, but I'm totally a crazy nut job. There's nothing something. underneath me, so... I know you're strapped in, but still. I gotta try something at least once to say I don't like it. Yeah, I don't know if I need to. <laughs> That's the difference between me and you. There's where... I'm assuming that's rainwater that comes out of there. I would think so. And then comes down along here. There goes another kid. <laughs> you just like whip it. around. And then goes into the lake. You see, we walked pretty far. And we're almost at oh. the main street. Now you gotta try to figure out how oh, you're gonna no. get across again. There's a little bridge. Yeah. Right by the seagull. Can I do it? I'm gonna hike up my skirt a little bit just because the bottom might get Let's wet. See. Is it squishy? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, that wasn't bad. It's like mud patties. That, that wasn't bad. I'm definitely hungry. I don't know about you. Well, it's almost lunch now. Yeah. <laughs> So this is the main street coming up for you people that have watched the live stream from yesterday. Smash You've seen Burger. it. Smash Burgers Express. You want to go up to the street? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, well, I guess you can go on that side too. It's not just that. Oh, it part. keeps going down there. Yeah. Eh? I'll have to walk down there later. Let's see what that side looks like. A lot of these places are probably still closed, like the restaurants. I don't know. It's almost it's 11. They're probably just starting to open up. Yeah, that's true. 11's lunchtime. This is the sand right this, here. The good sand oh, right here. Soft. Soft and squishy. Almost like walking in snow, oh. except for it's not freezing. All right. We're going to cross the street. 
Smashed Burger Express. Royal Fish and Chips. I'm definitely getting ice cream today. I don't care what you say. I didn't say anything anyway. But <laughs> you can get ice cream whenever you like. <laughs> There's a candy shop down there. The candy shop has pineapple find crush. The water at her place. Yeah. What's your favorite flavor of crush? You did a great job on that ladder. Probably would be pineapple or all of the above. However, I don't, due to the sugar content, I have to refrain. I don't like grape like crush. No, me neither. Like I like it, but I can only have it once every five years or so. Take a sip. <laughs> Let's look at this stuff. Fifty percent off. That's a bargain. Is it a bargain? You want to get a drug rug? No. <laughs> I'm not going to go in the stores either. Oh, this is the one I was in yesterday. Nice little beach shops. It's your dresses. Whoa, it's almost pants, fell. It's pants, but it's a romper. It's a what? It's pants. <laughs> like pants. It's like MC Hammer pants. I know, I kind of like it. <laughs> it's cute. You got the flip flops out here. I totally rock that. Fifty percent off. You know, right? I'm always down for a cute sundress. Uh, over there, you got Giggles Arcade and Stay Sweet Candy and Pop Shop, which I just kind of showed you. These are rompers too. Shut your face. Look at this uh, sucker. Joanne's in romper heaven. <laughs> Oh my god, this is like fat girl gone to heaven outfit. <laughs> I can eat as much as I want, nobody would know. <laughs> Pink is not my color though. You can see the beach out there across the street. That's how close this shop is. You can keep walking. Next week, I think it's next week, they have like a music festival down here. I can't show you the stage because it's on the other side of the building here, but it's not completely set up. All right, we're back. Joanne finished her shopping. <laughs> and, well, not shopping, browsing. <laughs> Hello. Now you gotta watch these sidewalks here. <laughs> They're all slanted. I almost slid down one yesterday because my feet were a bit Sorry. sandy. But yes, there's how you know where you are. Right when you drive down the main street, that's right at the end of the street. There's the, uh, what's this? The Lakeshore store. This, the sign reminds me of uh, Jersey Shore. The Shore store. But this is the Lakeshore store. Which way you want to walk on this side? Sure. Or this side. Yes, I gotta get coffee. Oh yes, there's a coffee place on this side of the street. And we got a lot of Sabo Beach shirts. Some of them are pretty nice. There's one, I think it's one of these stores. They're like twenty dollars for hoodies. I may have to check twenty that bucks out. for a hoodie. That's what I'm thinking. That is pretty cheap. This is where I got our blanket. Yes, it is, and they got more of these hoodies things. Drug rugs. Drug rugs, as people call them, I guess. <laughs> We got one of these. 20 bucks for a blanket. Right there. Oh, there's the shirts. See? Really That's yeah. Sabo Beach shirt right there. Got sunglasses. There's a whole bunch of them. Yeah, some of them are nice, eh? Mm -hmm. We'll have to check it out. We got a tattoo shop here. In case you need to get your Sabo Beach tattoo. In case a shirt isn't permanent enough. <laughs> or you're impulsive like me. Or that. <laughs> you just do random things at random times. So many beach shops. There's what shorts, is? which I forgot my swim shorts, but I don't think I'm going to need them now. I still really like this. <laughs> it's like my white one I have, but it's my favorite color if you like. There's Jack and Jill's surf shop. There's like three locations of Jack and Jill's just within like five minutes walking distance of each other. And this is the street our motel's on, 2nd Avenue North. It's a bit of a walk down that way. Well, as you saw, you walked with us down here. There's Beach Burger. 
Beach Burger is a pretty cool place. The patio is nice. They have like a drink bar off to the side. We had we got, karaoke last night. Yeah, karaoke know. last night. I think there's a band tonight. If weather permitting, I'm assuming. Weather permitting, yeah, I would think. It's not really the cheapest place. No. So I got the Beach Burger, which they're known for, which has pineapple, female bacon, tomato, lettuce, Look at this top. other stuff. And, it, and Joanne got poutine, and it came to like 30 bucks. So cute. Uh. Oh. Hey, buddy. Is this where you're going to go get your coffee? Yeah. Amici's Coffee Bar. Espresso cheese? coffee and gelato. All three, please. <laughs> Are you going to get coffee? Yes. Would you like something? No, I'm going to wait out here, though. Coca Mocha. Oh, that might be good. That's chocolate and chocolate And, and the building's coffee. purple. Yeah. So we're going to wait out here while Joanne goes in and gets coffee, and we will be back. Just... All right, we're back. Got my coffee. Joanne has got her coffee or her piping hot caffeinated beverage, as Adam the Woo likes to say. <laughs> what did you get? Just a regular coffee? Just a regular coffee. Their espresso machine is currently down for 20 minutes until the owner comes to fix it. Huh? I do enjoy the sign on there. It says, support your local caffeine dealer. Oh. Not your drug dealer, <laughs> your caffeine dealer. For my coffee. Level so you're good there. now you got coffee. Well, I'm always good. Oh well, yeah. <laughs> There's Garage Clothing Company. Established in 1979. More beach clothes. I put cinnamon on my coffee. How is it? Delicious. Would you like to try it? No. It's seriously really good coffee. <laughs> I'll pass on the coffee, but thank you. I did get a caramel coffee muffin too. Caramel coffee muffin? Mm -hmm. so this That's too hard to resist. That doesn't sound too bad. <laughs> The street down here is already pretty much filled with parking. I think it still might be busy today. I think it'll still be Probably because even if it ready. rains or it's cloudy, you still got to make the best of your trip, right? I mean, I'm still cool with going to the beach. Like Just I'm... nut and fudge, Bruce County. Nut and fudge. I'm assuming they sell nuts and fudge. Hmm. You can rent the oh. extreme boat jet ski side by side. You got that one going over there. Oh no, it's just blowing up the. Uh, Paddleboard. The Grab Lab. So this, you remember these in Toronto? Yeah. Just all claw machines. We love to see your pics of the gravel sob. What the Grab Lab Sobble? I just spit that out. Let's take a look. You want to take a look? You get all sorts of this different things. What is this? Me? What do you think? <laughs> You're in the machine. Grab lab me. <laughs> That's hilarious. I'll be your nice pick for. Prize. You are my winning prize. <laughs> That's neat. Can't actually put coins in there. That would be hilarious. I think it's just for. Like, just for looks. You know, for a good selfie. Wait, there's hot dogs. Hot dogs. Yeah, there's one hot dog in there. Some dinosaurs. These are really fun. Some unicorns. I'm never good at these. Look at there's a sloth in there. Who? Oh. A sloth. Is it a sloth? Yeah, right there. <laughs> it's cute. It's Nemo. I have a Nemo on my Look at these things. Look, I have a Nemo. There's a Nemo. <laughs> Look at the size of these. Oh, okay. we can get cards and stuff too. This place is pretty big. Oh, is this a, like a coin pusher? But it's a marble pusher? I feel like your friend Lorelai would like this place. <laughs> yeah, sweetly Lorelai, this is your place if you're watching. If you're in Sobble Beach. Have any of you ever been to a place that just has claw machines? The grab lab. It's a gray sloth. That's cute. I feel like I might start putting some in my coffee. That's good. This looks like uh, the old air hockey. <laughs> 
It's a tabletop grab machine. Oh, there's like mini ones? Yeah. They're like, they're like for keychains. Oh, keychains? Look at that. Like keychains. <laughs> That's neat. Well, it must be pretty easy. These kids got shopping carts full of toys. That's like in Toronto. Remember they were walking around with shopping carts full of toys? There's oh, duck party. Should we get one for Corey? Get some ducks. You gotta get a card and fill the card up. A lot of different ducks though. I guess there's an Elvis duck in there. There's a surf order duck. That's wicked. <laughs> so many. There's a panda one over there. These are so fun. There's a, a block duck square. You see it? Mm -hmm. You guys see the square duck? There's a purple one back there. I got a poop duck. <laughs> no, no poop huh. ducks. Oh, they even got they got candy ones. You get some candy. These ones are crazy though. Look at that thing. It's huge. Fantastic prize. I don't know what you got to do for these ones. So yeah, that is the grab lab. And head back out into the street where it's getting warm. Oh, there's another uh, photo op there. I like this. Yeah. Welcome to Sabo Beach. <laughs> there's the thumbnail. Actually, cool. I'm going to put this down. Yeah, get in there. Yeah. Let's do it. Okay, get in here. It's just a video. That's okay. <laughs> oh, I almost fell over. <laughs> There's a picture. There it is. Thank you, <laughs> random lady. <laughs> Sorry, we're back outside. Oh, my coffee. But, but don't forget your coffee. <laughs> it's like liquid gold right now. Jeez. All right, we're back outside. I told you I was a squirrel. 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 <laughs> we got happy donuts. It says it's open. Dessert bar, fire and go, flame, fried pizza. The world's smallest muffin. As you can see, the street is pretty full. This is my, sh this is my store I like. Is it? Oh, mm -hmm. it's a shore thing. So that place has, what would you say, like cottage decor? Yeah. There's signs and stuff to put at your cottage. We could take a look at inside, not inside the store, but we'll take a look up front. I will look inside the store though for you. Okay, Joanne's going to look inside the store while we wait outside. What's in the clearance section? Clearance? These are full. Different wind chimes. I don't know if they're wind chimes. Rain, rain chimes. Chime. So they collect the rain and they overflow and then they trickle. Oh, I've never even heard of a rain chime before. Oh my god, look at me. <laughs> You're a mess over here. I am. Look at this tree made out of driftwood. Again, see, I'm doing my room, so I need to get some more decor. That's cool. So, yeah, that's basically what this store is. All stuff for the cottage. <clears throat> it's a shore thing. So I lost Joanne in the shore store. She's checking out some stuff. So we're going to head on and check out some of the shops and meet up with her in a little bit. All right. So you see the streets filling up. Got a Dairy Queen right here. Ice cream is always good when you're in a little beach town. And I do love myself a blizzard. Oh, look at that. Bar Tiki. 
Salvo Beach licensed mini putt and patio. I might have to check that out. Maybe do a mini putt video. Over here we got the patch, vintage and secondhand shop. That place has some pretty good stuff, but it was up with my gimbal. There you can see over there. Giving life to secondhand since 1992. So they have a lot of stuff inside. A lot of shirts. And it's just random stuff. I think I need to move away from this area. This place across the street is nice. Grit and Grace. I'm going to tell you though, you got to pay a pretty penny for some of the clothes in there. And this is part of the patch as well. They sell jewelry and bracelets as you can see. I believe there's smells in there. And that's basically the end of it for uh, for shops. There's the Golden Eagle Motel. Housekeeping, cottages. It looks pretty nice. They got like a playground, a common area back there with a barbecue. It smells like somebody's barbecuing actually. But that'd be pretty neat to rent out. It's right on the main street. You even have a gift shop. I don't know what the gift shop would be like. And then up there is the street. When you take a right, it will take you to Port Elgin. Oh, and this place. We talked about this on the live stream yesterday. Casero. So that's a double decker bus that sells Mexican food. The taco bus. I might have to try that because I do like Mexican. And they have a licensed patio over there, which is very cool. I'm gonna head back and see if we can find Joanne. So yeah, it looks like people are still out making the best of their trip, even though there's no sun today. We are here until tomorrow, so watch out. Maybe a live stream. Well, I can say watch out, but you're not going to see this video until after I'm home. So you can watch out all you want. <laughs> Just check, check my last live streams. That Grit and Grace place has a nice Volkswagen van out front. You can take pictures with it. Get your selfie with the Volkswagen van. Maybe I'll cross and go check it out. I don't want to die. Oh, it looks like I'm good. So yeah, here's the Grit and Grace Volkswagen van. This place is really nice. I mean, look at it. They got the Muskoka chairs or the Adirondack chairs, whichever you will. And a swing over there you can just sit on. There's the mini putt with the licensed patio. You can bring your drinks out there. Prove that you love me and buy the next round. That's hilarious. It's Mercedes. So there you can see. Bar Tiki. Looks very bushy back there. Keep, out, keep an eye out for Joanne on the other side of the street. You can see more of the mini putt. It looks like they have a pond back there, but I don't know if there's any water in it. And the benches here are pretty cool. Check out the bench. Sabo Beach. If you ever get a chance, I highly suggest coming to Sabo Beach. And hopefully the weather is nice when you do come. It does get rather crowded down here, but I mean, it's a beach town, so you can expect that. This place is for sale. Can you imagine living right on the main street in Sabo Beach? I bet you that house is not cheap. Nick's Family Dining. And there's another Jack and Jill's. There, the pavilion. There's where the Grab Lab is. Happy Donuts and Fire and Dough. 
nut and fudge, the garage, and off in the distance you see the Savo Beach sign. So before I go any further, I'm going to go back to a shore thing and see if Joanne is almost done. And then we'll be back for the rest of the street on the other side. All right, I found her. She's back. She made some purchases, <laughs> as you can see. And it's funny because we were just talking about a Volkswagen van, the one that's up in front of that uh, ship. If I could live in it, I probably would. <laughs> All right, we're going to flip the camera around and keep going. This is an okay. amazing coffee. All right, we're back, kids. <laughs> All of the children. The coffee's good. Oh my God, I never knew cinnamon was so good in coffee. Who knew? I, I did not. There's another mini putt place down the road there, which is more geared towards kids, I think. If they still think I need to kick your ass in mini putt before we go. We might. I mentioned we might do mini putt. There's another Jack and Jill's. This one's cute. It's little. It's a little tiny one, yes. Come in. We're so happy you're here at Jack and Jill's. This is not a Jack and Jill's, but look at all the beach chairs and another Salvo Beach bench. We, These benches are awesome. We're going to need to invest in some beach chairs. We do need to sometime. Especially these ones. This one has the backpack. Yeah, that chair has a backpack in the back. Look at that. You can just carry it like a backpack, put your stuff in there. And then you got a beach chair. I know what I'm getting you for Christmas. <laughs> some more stuff out here. Some beach gear, beach bags. The lady it's, in the store told me I need to move here. She, she said, did. She said I have a Sobble Beach vibe. <laughs> she knows a beach girl when she sees one. You are a beach girl. <laughs> My happy place. Purple there. bench. Purple bench. Go sit on the purple bench <laughs> at Sobble Beach. Just like this. Ah. There you are. <laughs> That's my bench. That's your bench. <laughs> the purple bench. If you don't know, it's Adam's favorite color. <laughs> Mine is yellow, know. which is coming up next. Oh, the yellow bench. Can you imagine living in this place? It'd be great. I mean, it would be great because you're close to the beach, but it, and it'd be great for people watching, but it would probably be so loud at night. Only till a certain time, though. I mean, <sighs> probably, I think things probably shut down around here. Like around 11 or 12. Yeah. I'm guessing. Because it's cottagey and people still come for their their family time. Relaxation and peace and quiet. Hopefully the battery lasts for this whole video. This kid's so excited he's <laughs> not at the beach. He's a beach kid. He is a beach kid. <laughs> There's the yellow bench. There's the yellow bench. There it is. There's me on my Yellow bench. It's Joanne on the yellow bench. <laughs> now this is Second Avenue again, which is the street our motel is on. I'm almost done my there. coffee. Hmm? There's Bikini Paradise. See all those umbrellas? I thought that was actually a patio yesterday with drinks, but it's just beach umbrellas. It's this way, but I wanted you to stop. Um, we're following the Beach umbrellas and bikinis. <laughs> There's another purple bench. Mm -hmm. Two things we shall buy. Beach umbrella and a bunch of chairs. And I feel like you really need this shirt. No, I don't like that shirt. Why? Look how cool he is. I don't like it. <laughs> it does have a flamingo on it, but maybe like that. The monkey with the bananas? <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, well, that pretty cool. They got some really cute things in here. I think this is where I bought my bathing suit last year when I forgot it, remember? I think it is. The top? Yeah. The most important part? I mean, <laughs> it is legal in Ontario. However, nobody wants to see these guys. <laughs> There's bubble cup. Smoothie, bubble tea, ice cream rolls, and waffles. Now, if you guys watched my first time eating Filipino food, they had ice cream rolls at the Filipino festival, which I had never seen them done before. And it's very Strawberry cool how they do it. Strawberry waffles. That sounds delicious. The what? Strawberry waffles. It's, 
Is it weird that they sell waffles at an ice cream shop? Maybe no. not because you have waffle cones. You eat waffles and chicken. That's true. There's the cabana. This place I like. A really I got my great store. Flip flops here last year. Me too. Remember? Yeah. We need a new flip flops. Together. Again, it's not the cheapest place, but it does have some really neat stuff. But you're going to get and a lot of wear out of them, and you're currently wearing those yes, flip flops. The flip flops I have on now, I've had for a year, and they're still perfect. Here's the cone. They serve Kawartha Dairy Ice Cream. Rustic Pizza Company. Oh, that looks delicious. What? The pizza. Oh, I didn't see the With pizza. With oven pizza, isn't it? I don't Maybe? know. Maybe not. There's Chip and Patty. Fresh cut fries, grilled burgers, and poutine. And there's the sign. We're back at the beach. Now we're going to walk down the street and we'll check out some of the cottages and restaurants that are down here. Hopefully the battery lasts. <laughs> well, and there's on the sign there, it says there's a place called Meats and More. Really? With a beach chicken on top yes, of the sign. <laughs> a beach chicken on top of the sign. Looks like there's more people out at the beach now. Surprisingly, it's not it's not sunny, but it is hot. It is hot. You want to walk on this side? Sure. This is the place we walked earlier. There's some doggies. <laughs> I'm just going to walk bare feet. <laughs> You're going to walk in the sand? Yep. On the side of the road, it's great. <laughs> oh, who needs shoes? Flip-flops for life or There's bare feet. Aerial course. I want to see somebody go on the zip line. I wonder how much it is to do. I don't know. Like I said, you wouldn't catch me up there. It's not for me. Somebody's going to go when I'm not watching. No, there's somebody going on the little whoopee thing oh, that I want to go on. Oh my God, that'd be me. Ah. Where'd they go? Right Where'd there. Yeah, see, that's crazy. <laughs> no, I love it. That I would not do. No. Nope. Is somebody else going to go? Oh, no, we're know. going on the bungee. Stop for a second. And we'll stop and see if somebody goes on that zip line again. Somebody else is going up top there, I think. We've got a couple of people lined up for it. I want to do that red thing so much. Oh, the kid's <laughs> going to do the bungee. These kids got more guts than I do. But it doesn't go fast. No. We watched it yesterday. But it's, it's still high. Pretty, it's high, but... I need a battery back. Here we go. <laughs> oh, there we go. Would you guys try that? I would <laughs> Look at totally this. do it. That's hilarious. It just flings you all over the place. And then bam, you stop. <laughs> I think it's great. I'm at 35%. This battery goes down so quick. I don't think you've had a full actual charger though since we got here, so that's probably why. It was on the charger. No, it wasn't on the charger last night. You can get a poke bowl and a bobo tea. Poke what a, bowl? I'm not even sure what that is. And boba tea? I'm not sure either, to be honest. I've never had either of those. Look at this cottage. It's nice. Literally right on the beach. I need to work from home job so I can just live at the beach and work from home. Yeah. <laughs> That's ideal. Nice. There's a couple of cottages here right on the beach. Can you do pharmacy online? I don't know if you can do online pharmacy. Hopefully you guys can't hear this music, but... <laughs> if you can, just plug this your ears. Is, yeah, YouTube, plug your ears. <laughs> this is Sola's Grill. This is apparently good. It was packed last yeah, night. Yeah, this place had a lineup yesterday. It's not open yet by the looks of it. But they do have a nice patio here, as you can see. Don't the menu's the over music. there. La, la, la. I it's can't get the menu. There's too much music. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm not going to look at the menu. The menu looked good, though. So we're going to keep on walking. There's a smashed burgers and bar. This place looks really nice. Yeah. This place wasn't as crowded yesterday, but it's still pretty busy. Make it a super margarita. 
And over here, this, this is the place I want to try. I don't know if I'm going to. 1858 Caesar Bar. Oh, and there's a Chinese place takeout in the back. There's like a... Um, there's what? A little sign with drinks on it. Hi, wiener dog. Oh Hello my God, doggy. you're so cute. <laughs> Hi. Hi, sweet boy. Hi. How tiny the dog Hello. is. <laughs> you're bigger than my, my purse is bigger than you. <laughs> oh my God, he's cute. Hi. Hello. He thinks he's a bite. <laughs> Do you want to come with me? He's got one blue eye and one brown eye. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> come on, little guy. Oh, yeah, you can't fight for one day. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. You too. I was just looking at the oh, social the hour, 4 to 7 p.m. One pound of wings, $13. That's pretty good. We can always do two pounds of wings and a couple beers. It's not too bad. do that. I well, like the sign. If you come here, you have to get a Caesar, though. I would have to get a Caesar. And you can park here for 20 bucks. Pitcher and wings, $30. That would be great, except Joanne doesn't eat wings. They even made the sand all nice. In front I know, of it. such a good photo op. So I might have to try this place. I mean, I'm a fan. It's got palm, fake palm trees on the patio. And it does too, and they got music playing too. God damn it! <laughs> Please do not lean on the glass. What is this? Real estate company? Model Max tonight. We better buy a couple tickets while we're up here. They could be the winner of winter chicken dinners up here. <laughs> it could be. And then we can we just move here. The beach barber shop. Well, yesterday they were cutting hair right on the porch there. I think that's neat. great. Beachside bakery. Mm -hmm. Kayak and paddleboard rentals. Loaded best fries oh. and ribs. Mm -hmm. Slushies, you had me at slushies. Yeah, oh, slushies. I remember slushies from Vegas. Ve Five dollar funnel cakes, some kettle corn. This place is yes. where we're gonna live. Check out this hotel. It's not currently open. Not yet. They're still building it, but look at those balconies. And it's called the Sands. Just like Las Vegas. The Sands Hotel. Not a bad seat in the house. That's nice, eh? The glass balconies. They already got the uh, Muskoka slash Adirondack chairs out there. Still got work vehicles here. It's going to be beautiful. I bet you it's like wicked stunning inside. Oh, yeah. Full glass windows. I like beautiful fixtures and furnishings. And if you want to check it out, you can check it out at thesands.ca, which I might have to check that out later. And I need to charge my phone as soon as we get to the car. So here's a bunch of, well, I don't know if all of these are cottages you can rent. But I mean, I'm there's assuming a lot of them are. Probably people that live here year round too. Like that one on the corner, I love that one. I would definitely live here year round in that house. Yes. Just give me a Look fireplace. I bet you the beach is still pretty at winter in winter, like the snow and oh yeah, probably. ice. As much as I hate it. I even got like an ATV back there. That's pretty cool. That place is really nice. That is so nice. I like the, um, I don't even think that's not wood up top. It's like patinaed oh, metal. Yeah. I like the wood and the stone and the metal together like that. It is a really nice. That's really cool. There's no parking along this side of the street or the left side of the street. No, right but now. there's lots of sand for your toes it is. to walk in. I like how the sand is over here too. Me too. I don't have to wear shoes. I can't believe how warm it is. Yeah, it's warming up. If the sun was out, it'd be, oh, it'd be so hot. <laughs> we would uh, be at the beach instead. Oh, yeah, that's true, too. <laughs> 
toes in the water, booty in the sand. <laughs> no stopping, standing, or parking anytime. It's Toe a good thing we're walking. Up. We're allowed to walk. I'm going to stand there and see if somebody comes and picks me up and tows me away. <laughs> I'm, somebody gives you a ticket for standing? I'm going to chance it. <laughs> Risk it for the biscuit. <laughs> Maybe if the phone is charged, we could do a live stream in Port Elgin. I this place is nice. The, the lake gardens. house. Beautiful. These gardens are crazy. I love it. Needs a water feature, though. It does. Just for that. A little stream. The lady in the store where I got the stuff said, if you're close enough at night, like you live close enough, or you're staying close enough, if the wind is blowing, you can you usually can hear the waves. Oh, really? Yeah, because she asked where we were staying, and I said, oh, about a block. And she's like, oh, can you hear the waves? I said, no, hasn't been wavy or windy. So she said, well, on a good night, you can hear it. Hmm. Yeah, I guess if the wind is blowing the right direction. Kind of like Niagara Falls. Yeah. If the wind is the right way, you can hear the roar. Check my battery. Oh, I probably got enough, 30%. This dog's going for a bike ride. <laughs> He's in a little dog carrier. My dog would love it up here. He could swim every day. Can't bring dogs on the beach though. There's got to be a spot somewhere where probably. dogs There's can go. 11 kilometers of beach, I'm sure they got a They need a dog, dog beach, area. come on now. Like a dog park. If you're a beach dog, you need a beach park for a dog. Yeah. They like to swim. They get their exercise. Well, this place is for rent. Looks like they probably have a few units in here. I think next year we should look into a cottage rental with a bunch of people for a week. And just make some good memories with some good friends. That's a pretty good idea. You split the cost. It's pretty... Pretty decent book now. Right across the street from the beach. Mm -hmm. Two days doesn't suffice. And your girl needs a campfire. A campfire would be nice. <laughs> it gives you a whole year to work on your Boy Scout <laughs> so I can learn skills. How to make a fire. Yes. YouTube tutorials, here we come. <laughs> we got some really nice cottages coming up here for rent. This one doesn't say for rent, but it has a nice porch or veranda, I whichever like you one. prefer to call it. I like the one next door. Yes, we'll get to that one in two seconds. That is for rent. There it is right here. We may buy it tonight when I win the lottery. This one is for rent. That's really nice. Beautiful. I like the big patio door. Yeah, I'm not going to focus on too much because there's people there, but you guys got a quick glimpse of it. <laughs> this one's also for rent. With the lavender, I do like this one. This has got the cool chair. Yeah, this one's got lavender out front. Look at it. that cool chair. Look at the chairs. Even the front yard's like sand. So awesome. I love it. Big windows in the front. With the chairs there. Need a fire feature. <laughs> you definitely could have a little fire pit out front in front of that little bed thing. Yeah. Like a chimenea or just a fire bowl. And then you have the little cottages like this. <laughs> that one's got a nice porch up there. Mm -hmm. Some of these are probably like year-round homes. Some of them are probably just cottages, second oh. properties for people to rent. Here comes another nice one. Yeah, that one's got a nice balcony. Well, yeah, the balcony is nice. That looks like a real house. Yeah. 
when you're up on that balcony, you could probably see the beach over top of the sand dunes. That one also has lavender. Mm -hmm. I don't think I'd need lavender to help me sleep out here. I think it would just happen naturally. Yeah. It's so peaceful and zen. It's definitely my happy place. The beach or Sabo Beach? Um, the beach, but I would definitely, if the opportunity came to live here, I wouldn't second guess it, I don't think. I don't need much to keep me happy. Just the, just the beach? Just the beach, <laughs> a few little shops. Now this place has a nice balcony too. I like the glass railings up there. This is the street we walked down last night with all the, when yes. we did those shadow pictures. Is that ours? All right, guys, that's it for this walk. If you liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you get notified whenever mm -hmm. I do videos, we do videos, food reviews, room reviews, all that stuff. And we're out for this episode. We'll see you in the next. Ciao. Bye.